The next element to be sure to include and emphasize is nurturing diversity. We want to make sure we seek out, acknowledge, and enc encourage diverse community perspectives and languages. One great website you might want to check out is the We Need Diverse Books website that has some great links to resources to help you diversify your offerings. Um, you also want to use non-English language phrases as much as possible and encourage families to communicate in their home language as well. Um, many of you have heard of something called windows and mirrors. I'm actually going to read a quote um, from Rudine Sims Bishop that talks about this. Um, many people have heard that phrase but are not always sure about where it comes from. So I'm going to read this quote. Books are sometimes windows offering views of worlds that may be real or imagined, familiar or strange. These windows are also sliding glass doors and readers have only to walk through in imagination to become a part of whatever world has been created and recreated by the author. When lighting conditions are just right, however, a window can also be a mirror. Literature transforms human experience and reflects it back to us. And in that reflection, we can see our own lives and experiences as part of the larger human experience. Reading then becomes a means of self-affirmation and readers often seek their mirrors in books.